Hey everybody, it's Sean from High Level. I just wanted to jump in and show you a really awesome big update that is coming down the pike and today is on beta. So if you take a look over here at the left hand menu, you will notice it looks a little different, right? So for, let's jump into an, uh, an account here and I'll show you uh, what this is really all about. So first of all, that switcher that you just saw was a little different and now that's, this left menu is significantly different. So what's going on here and uh, why are we switching this up? So um, quick uh, thing here. So if you've worked with us or been with us for a while, you know that that left menu just grows and grows and grows and grows and over time it becomes confusing not only to often your customers but even yourself, right? And so we really wanted to go back and re-architect the UX here to make it much simpler for both you and honestly your customer when they come into the app to sort of get going, see what they need to see and do the things they need to do. So let's take a look really quick at what changed uh, and how we try to make this a lot better. So um, up here on the left-hand side, everything is effectively still here, just the way you've always known it. Some of the items may have changed positions. What we try to do is break things uh, between uh, at this upper section here. These are the types of things that we would assume or would, would believe that a, a small business would be doing in the app sort of daily. And things down here would be sort of the things your agency would do. And then of course we still have these custom left-hand menu items that all of you can add. Um, but one thing that has always bothered me is clicking on contacts and then having to click contacts again. So watch this. Now I go to the contacts menu and it's gonna immediately take me into the actual contact section, which is precisely where you wanna go 99.9% .9 of the time. But what about all those other drop down, sort of push down menus that we had? Where did those go and what's the deal there? Well, if you take a look across the top, we now have them sitting right here. So it's still easy to get to all of the things that you could get to before, but this time what's happening is we're putting you in the space where honestly, you're gonna want these things sometimes, but most of the time you're just gonna be over here. So this sort of theme continues through every single uh, other section of the app here. And you can take a look and explore this right now for yourself. So if you go in and you actually hit up beta.gohighlevel.com, you can log in with the exact same credentials that you log into today. So I think that's a huge win. A Couple other things to point out here. So settings. So uh, the nice thing here is we have both a global settings menu. Let me move my head here, whoop. Down here at the bottom, we have the settings and we also have them contextually. So let's say I wanna go to calendar settings, I can click here and now I'm actually in the calendar uh, section of the new settings, which as you can see, we have now moved this to a left menu treatment so it's consistent, whereas before it, you had to remember to jump up here to the top and you had this sort of ever growing list that would sort of uh, uh, keep stacking down. And so now when I go to settings directly, of course you can see kind of the full uh, settings menu, the same settings as you have today. So nothing here has changed. It's just, we've tried to organize them quite a bit differently. Um, then a couple other things here. So switching to your agency, you can do that down here in the bottom left. Uh, and then up here, um, obviously the switcher uh, is also, you can switch to the agency view here. And again, uh, you can also see all of your accounts here like you're used to. Same search functionalities and capabilities are here um, as well. And we'll also be uh, rolling this out so that the last, I think it's five locations that you switch to will be sort of at the, at the top here uh, shortly because obviously if you do a lot of switching between the same accounts, that'll make life a lot easier uh, when you're trying to go back and forth. So um, I think this is really important from uh, two, two perspectives. A, um, you know, we really uh, worked hard to try to make this a much simpler feeling app, um, especially as we've grown, we've added a lot of functionality and sometimes that can get in the way. And the other thing is, you know, we really wanna get your feedback. So, you know, the team has obviously worked hard um, at this. We've given some uh, previews of this um, already before, but um, we wanna make sure that before we uh, sort of spring this on you, that you know what's coming. now. To that point, uh, opting in will it will be an opt-in process, not an opt-out process. So you'll you'll have to choose, um, and it'll be something that, as an agency, uh, you're going to be making that decision, obviously. Um, but long term, we do want to move to this uh, sort of look and feel sort of universally. Uh, but before we do that, obviously, we want to make sure everybody's on board. So take a look at this, um, jump into it, give us your feedback, let us know uh, what you're thinking, and we're excited to bring this to you. Um, it's certainly something that has been in the works for some time. So I hope all of you are having an awesome Thursday. And again, head over to beta.go high level right now to take a look. Thanks, talk soon.